welcome to Nettie's Notes. This week we are making another one of our favorite pies. A couple of weeks ago we made pear pie and this week we're making chicken pot pie. So tell us in the comments below what is your favorite pie. This is an easy recipe. It's on the back of my favorite pie crusts. They have a couple of options back here and one of them is easy chicken pot pie. The reason I like this recipe is because it literally has three parts to it. Crusts, one for the top and one for the bottom, a bag of mixed vegetables, and a can of chicken. Now of course it's not quite that easy. You start by making your sauce and today I have my helpers Naomi and Eli with me. They went ahead and already made the sauce for us. The sauce is easy. A third cup of butter melted in a pan, a third cup of chopped onion, a third cup of flour, a half teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of pepper one and a third cups of chicken broth, and I like to make my chicken broth on the stove quickly with chicken bouillon, and then a half cup of milk. <music> Naomi and Eli went ahead and made this broth, as you can tell, and now comes the easy part. Eli's gonna dump in the chicken, and then the vegetables. dump in the chicken into the sauce and mix it up. Now our family needs two pies so today we have two crusts ready and we'll just go ahead and dump that into the crusts and cover them and then our dinner is done. so easy. Now we have two chicken pot pies for dinner. We'll just cover them with the other crust. pies are done. That was easy. Kids can help with pie and it's a quick dinner. And as you can see, Naomi is very creative. She carved an apple into the top of her pie. Now we bake them on a sheet so they don't leak onto the bottom of the oven at 425 for 30 to 40 minutes. Thanks for joining me today on Nettie's Notes. I hope that you have a happy fall and try some delicious pie. Pie is healthy and fun and easy. We'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.